Hello everyone and welcome back to some more Half-Baked Gaming. Here we are today inside of Valheim with a new addition to the portal pad. And some new map markers made out that we need to go and explore. What in the heck? Oh yeah, that was all the treasure I found. That's right, let's just clean that up now. We have three frost caves as well as one point of interest to go check out. That's a really cool spot. And this little meadow black forest in the middle of that, I wouldn't mind setting up there one day, maybe. This is probably one of the most common section of planes that there is in the world. And then this probably isn't. <laughs> However, we're gonna go and explore our mountain. And see what that gets us for today. Currently, I should be done with silver. I might need it in the future, but for now, we have a whole big mountain we can tap into my old mountain before it's pretty well dry out from silver it seems no way oh it did hit but it didn't kill oh never mind oh this jerk huh? there we go thank you all right all right with that out of the way let's go into our first frost cave man it seems we don't actually even pick for that I just hit it with a normal hammer Hmm, this is seeming to be a much smaller cave. Still full of bad stuff. Okay. Ancient cave markings. Interesting. Some look harpoon-like. I guess I don't really know what any of them are. Oh, a door. I think there's always supposed to be like cultists and stuff behind doors, but... Not today. Okay. Hmm, this is seeming like a really, really small cave. A little light, I guess. Oh, whoops. I say, didn't I pull up my weapon? Can I block fire? You cannot block fire. Oh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Fire's hot, fire's hot, fire's hot. Oh, just in time. Like little flame claws that they attack you with too. Now I'm starting to wonder if the health potion was necessary, and I think you can attack these two to get more juice. Yeah. Ooh, it's one of these places. Nice. We'll have to shoot that down and pick up all of our good hairs. Another claw. Don't get a lot of those. Oh boy, I don't think they liked it when I took out their curtain. I forgot the shield, didn't I? Is there anything else in front of This guy. Ow. Oof. Fire, 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 fire. Okay. More of this again in that room. And... Ooh, same thing with this room. Nice. Holy crap, 30 hair from all that already. Only one claw? Jeez, I thought I just picked up another claw here. Maybe it was a trophy. Alright, either which way, I think that that's it for this dungeon. That's fine, that was really cool. We're gonna move on to... Probably our point of interest, and maybe that dungeon up there. That way we can wrap back around and clean out this dungeon and come back here. For an exit. I suppose if I was smarter, I might have cut through the center for this meadow, but meh. There we are. Off in the distance, we just happened to discover a strange little structure here. What is going on with my computer today? Oi, oi, oi. I don't know. It's not like me running. But this chest has got, ooh, some goodies in it. And a motor location, which is holy crap, all in there's the planet. <laughs> oh, okay, well, that should be pretty interesting, folks. We'll have to give that a check out within an episode or two, I'm sure. Now, what's going on with this here? I can't tell why that's all glittery down there. No, it is just generic stones. Okay, all right. That's fine. I don't think there's anything up here. No, okay. Just wow, 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 wow. That's gonna take a whole journey on its own just to discover there. 
Okay. So I think then for the rest of this episode we're going to take out the last few frost caves. And at that point we're going to have to head back and start planning for this journey just to go find Motors Island and begin with. Flipping frost caves. Let's move in. Ah, I'm going back. <laughs> Just swinging like a mild man. Might as well use the two-handed. Oh, well, that's a good idea. So quick. Oh yeah, that's way more effective. Man, there's a lot of bats in here. Ooh, this is a bigger one. <laughs> Flipping bats. What is that? Oh, another claw, finally. That's good. I need a handful of those for the actual fist weapons, that's for sure, too. Damn, this is the big one. And behind door number one. A chair. Those damn chairs are at it again, aren't they? And door number two. That's the same. Oh, hello there, puppy dog. I'm running on with food. <laughs> Oops. What in the hell happened here? It looks like something's here, but it clicked into a torch. I don't. I don't want to know. Oh boy. They don't like it when I take down their curtains. Ooh, curtains with hair. Even better. Down, down, down we go. What do we got down here? More cultists, probably. Right. Ooh, crystal. Mm, door number three. Oh, okay. Hmm, this has a couple different branches off on it. Okay. Ooh. What are we up to now? Door number four? Ooh. Oh. Speed it down. Speed it down. Stop. Oh, stop. Stop, 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 stop. There we go. Look at this guy. What, uh, what you doing there? He's not too sure what he's doing. It's okay. Oh, hi. Take that fire leader. Ah, mm. Oh. It burns. Anyone home? Or was that that last group, maybe? Yeah, that's probably what that was. Maybe after today, we'll get enough to craft the set. And once we craft the set, we can actually check it out, maybe, for a small or major portion of an episode, depending on how much you end up getting upgraded and how well it is. Alright, looks like our final destination. Ooh, interesting. Is that it? Okay, yeah, I guess that's it, just some crystal. I guess it's just kind of a crystal mine portion. Alright, and on to the next one. If we're lucky, maybe in the next one we'll get a cultist trophy and we can actually make the hat to go with the set for the Fenris armor. And now for a long trip back down, and I might cut through the center portion because it's just going to save so much more time. This will give me a good chance too to take a look at the area in here, see if it's something I want to build in or not. Bad wolf face. I need the drake parts, but now is not the time for hunting, I'll do that later on. I don't even know what to say about that motor location, like, sailing is not the most entertaining thing in this game, it is a very peaceful moment at most times, besides when the serpent likes to show up, or an island pops out through the mist at you. Maybe what I'll do is see what's over there on my map, for islands, and maybe I can find an island that I could personally push to, to kind of set up a nice little base, satellite base on, and then we could start off from there for an episode perhaps with motors discovery of his location his island i don't think i'm going to take him on in the same episode but he does require a fair bit of prep work beforehand once you even discover his location finally oh hmm, that's neat i mean i should skip right past the first one we did somehow i mean i'm well underway for our next adventure it was totally intentionally planned what the hell is it's opening? Oh, up there. 
Oh, that's a cool little spot here. Mm -hmm. Just crystals down here again, it looks like. Just that down here, too. Well, that's good and all, I guess, but... You know, I'm not gonna lie, I was really hoping that one of these would have given us sufficient fun. <laughs> but, you know, treasure and werewolf hair is pretty good, too. Well, at least we got a door. Ah, the door of the I'm at lowish health. Losing fish. Need fish. There we go. Got some fish in my life. And that's it. Ooh, another door. Ah, that dog's... Ow. Nice job. <laughs> Take that, you stupid gate. It wasn't even a door, it was a gate. Damn gate with iron. Oh, I ain't taking that. I have to take a portal back home, so. Mm. Mm. Ooh. Oh. Thank you, I'm going to see. Oh, and again, I just clubbed him upside the head with one shot. <sighs> oh, okay, I've seen it wrapped around here. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I don't know. Let's see if that shield back out here. Oh, that hurt. See? Let me just regroup here. Oh. Spirit Demon's got him down. And he's slowed. Get him. Nice. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Cultist, cultist, cultist. I need a little bit more health. I don't want to waste the health potion. Alright, now I never end this. No. Flipping hell. Nope, nope, nope. Well, I guess. Too much choice in the matter. Potion it is. Oh. Whatever, it's only honey, it's only honey. <laughs> Are we clear now? No. Oh lord, okay, I got health at least. Oh, I'll shield you. Like, block it. Like, unimaginable. <sighs> Wreck the place, why don't I? Jeez. Oh, I got another wolf and look at my health. Let's play with the shield for a few minutes here. Whew, good hit on him there. Jeezy peace, are we clear yet? <sighs> oh. My body, oh. I don't know if anything's in there or not. We'll come out here by now, right? Right? Yeah, alright. This looks like the end of this place then, I believe. And on that note, maybe everyone, I'd like to thank you all for sticking around. I hope you have enjoyed, and next episode, I will leave Motor Island for us, but yeah, it's going to be a big trip that I don't think is going to be as entertaining as I would like it to be, as much as I love the sailing in this game, and it is good, and a peaceful, fun time. It's not as entertaining as it could be, and should be for YouTube, so we'll, uh, we'll come back with perhaps a base on an island since there's a little satellite base on an island somewhere nearby that and at that point we can continue on to motors island and explore that find his location so i can begin prep work on that area for his upcoming boss battle so be a couple episodes away but i'm sure we'll end up taking him on at the very least whether or not we'll succeed is a whole other story